guys, Adam here from representing Narva Australia. Today's topic is how to use a multimeter on the amperage scale. For setup tips, I covered a lot of that in the previous one on voltage setup and multimeter tips. So check out, there'll be a link below which you can click onto if you like, and you can go back to all that. But just a quick rundown for today is that I've got my black lead on the common, which is always, and my positive lead on the 10 amp side here, and my dial is set to the 10 amp scale. Now, what I've actually set up here at the moment is a quick demonstration so we can see the amperage draw of what the fridge is going to use when it's turned on. One of the reasons why we may do this is just so we know what kind of draw the actual fridge is actually having on the battery, which then we can sort of calculate how long the battery is going to last. Obviously on startup, the, bat uh, the fridge is always going to draw a lot more than when the, when the fridge has actually come down to temperature. But simple to show you really and what I've done is I've set up one of these Narva um, electrical power outputs here uh, just on the, the taking the negative to the negative on the fuse block here uh, and the positive side of things with it with a with an checking amperage the the actual current needs to flow through the machine or through the multimeter so basically what I've done is I'm using the probes to run the power through the probes into the machine and then back to the fridge if we have a look here I just connect the positive to, it doesn't really matter where, but to any of the, uh, of the positives on the, on the fuse block. And I connect the negative onto here, so the power is now actually flowing from the battery through the multimeter. The multimeter can pick up the amperage that it's actually drawing, so it's currently drawing 2.82 amps. And of course, once it comes down to temperature, that will drop off and it'll cut in and cut out. But ultimately, that gives us a really good indication of what kind of draw the fridge is actually using on startup. Guys, if there's any more tips or anything that you want to see, make sure you leave a comment below. Otherwise, I'll see you next time.